Hey there, welcome to this week's video. This is May Rinfro here with you. And um, yeah, I am in a motel room in Copley, Kansas. And so, what am I doing here? Well, okay, in my last video, but not the cemetery video, but the one before that, I said that we had a surprise in the works or planning and doing, and I didn't say what it was. And well, the surprise is that we're headed south. Uh, Jack to our Texas home for uh, some time. So, yeah, we're on the road trip. This yeah. is the third day down, one more day to go. And so we checked yeah. into the room, then we went to eat Chinese buffet, then we came back, um, jumped in the pool, had a bunch of fun, and then I'm here. And I'm going to show that. Hang on. So we just got a room for the night. So he's just sending us in, then we'll get in our room and we'll get to relax after a long day on the road. Third day down, one more to go. Days in in Colby, Kansas. I just had to mention it has a pool. So, here comes some fun. Didn't that look fun? Yeah, okay, so here we are. So hopefully everyone's gonna go to sleep like good girls. And yeah, speaking of girls, we are five girls in here. Mama and four of us girls, and the guys are in their room. So we've been having to get two rooms, so the guys are all in there, and I'm in here with the girls. And so I hope they're gonna settle down, but at least we got to go in the pool we over and ate and then the pool and we wore off some energy but these girls are still going at it here so um okay yeah this is like i said our third day on the road and it's been going pretty good so far and tomorrow will be the last day and we'll get to our texas home and yeah just there's a lot but it was a lot going on we kind of quickly decided uh and quickly got ready to go on our to go down here uh, to our texas home and uh so things are interesting on this trip traveling with that the COVID stuff we have to wear masks in the gas stations uh a lot and stuff and yeah kind of different than what we're used to the breakfast is here in the morning is different and everything but anyway it's still been going good so I had a few verses that's been on my mind that I really wanted to share, and I thought it was just kind of quite timely um, with kind of that's all going on. I mean, just already in this world with the pandemic stuff and COVID-19 and just all of this uncertainties and stuff. And then we have the U.S. elections coming right up. Uh, this is November the 3rd, election day, and so a lot of that is just you know not knowing how about it's going to go down and i was thinking of the verse and it's in second corinthians 5 7 for we walk not by sight but by faith we walk by faith but not by sight there i got it second corinthians 5 7 we walk by faith not by sight and i thought you know that's going to be when it's uncertain you know coming down here just before elections when people are talking about you know not knowing what's going to happen and all and i'm thinking well we walk by faith we walk with god not by sight not by fear we're not not by fear or anything don't just be quiet um but by just walking in the faith 
trusting in God. Uh, he's our guide and our instructor and our keeper wherever we are. And that reminds me of the verse I want to read in Joshua 1, 1 9. Have not I commanded thee, be strong and of good courage, be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed. The Lord thy God is with, with thee wherever thou goest. So you can see wherever we go, whether, you know, it's in wherever it is, the place of uncertainty and, and stuff. Um, and, um, we just, I know that God is with us wherever we go. So I want to be able to give you some encouragement and speaking to me right now and just to give you encouragement to that God is with you. He's surrounding you. Nothing is out of his control and that might seem out of our control and out of our hands and like, what's going on? Um, he's got it in control. Know that. Trust him. Just be a good cur courage. Be strong. Be courageous. And, and he uh, is our keeper and our shield. And in Isaiah 26, 3, it says, when we keep our minds on him, he'll keep us in perfect peace. So I just wanted to kind of close with that. And yeah, I really like that verse, we walk by faith, not by sight. And that really just really spoke to me. And I just want to share that just um, as we're coming on down here in the States and our uh, home in Texas um, with kind of everything that's happening right now. And... Um, even though it may have stay, seemed nice and, you know, neat just to stay put there, we had was prepared really for the winter there. Um, we had all our animals and all our garden stuff, everything put up, and then we just let all our, uh, got our animals off to our neighbors and all put our, gave our vegetables to surrounding neighbors and friends and, uh, and stuff and, and then headed on out. So, um, yeah, here we are, one day to go, and we'll be there, and... Yeah, I'll do another video for, uh, when I get there as soon as I can. I'm not sure how soon I'll have the internet and all to be able to do a video. So I just wanted to do this one, just check in, do this one, just kind of keep you updated, keep you uh, posted. And yeah, if you're following this and seeing this, I've only got 13 subscribers and only I only get about one to two views on all my videos. So if you're the one or the two watching, thank you. Hi, hi. This is just for you. Just for you then. And I'm excited. So you just keep watching these and uh, check me out my um, website and blog. And yeah, if you are new, you've come to here, then please subscribe. Click that button so you get notified when a new video comes out. Stay tuned for more. Be strong and be courageous. God is with you wherever you go.